Hey, my name is Steve and welcome to Command Shift New and our Logic Pro quick tips in three minutes or less. Today we're looking at how to customize the top toolbar. The toolbar at the top of the Logic Pro window is where you'll often find many useful controls. The transport tools like play, stop and record are all found here as well as tools like the metronome or the tuner. However, you can customize this display to add tools that you don't use regularly. To do this, go to the LCD display at the top in the middle and click the down arrow to the right. From this list, you will be able to select customize control bar and display. You can do this from any of the LCD display types, but to give yourself the most customization, first change the display to custom before trying to customize the control bar. You could also change it to the customize menu afterwards though. So why would you want to customize the control bar? Well, there are many great tools that are hidden that you may not know about, such as the capture record button that can capture a recording even if you didn't hit the record button before playing it in. Logic doesn't want to overcrowd the toolbar and possibly overwhelm you when you first start using it, but as you become more comfortable with Logic Pro, you may start to use some of these great tools and features that are hidden away by default. Just remember as well that if you like the way that you have your custom toolbar set up and you want to always keep it in that way, you will need to click the save as default button. That way, every new session that will be set up will be set up this way. And if you ever make a change just for that session and want to return back to the way that you had it, you can click the apply default to return to it or even revert to take it back to Logic's defaults. If you enjoyed this quick tip and would like to hear more, why not like the video and subscribe for the next one? You never know what new trick you might pick up. Happy music making and I'll see you in the next one.